Before I chat to my next guest, he's going to come out and sing for you the brilliant The Lost Art of Murder. Will you please welcome Pete Dockaday? <laughs> Could roll a four, could roll a nine Find yourself washed up in paradise Just like before, she never used to mind I lost my phone in paradise and What's a nice day for a murder? You call yourself a killer boy But the only thing you're killing is your time There's nothing absurder Than bird, it's just a burden To your heart, your soul, your body, spirit and mind I don't look at me like that She won't take you back You said too much You've been too unkind Get up off your back Stop smoking that You could change your life Do you think you'll change your mind? Could roll a four could roll a nine Find yourself washed up in paradise No light before, no light behind Someone else washed up in paradise and What's a nice day for a murder You call yourself a killer the only thing you're killing now is time There's nothing absurder Than bird that's just a burden To your heart, your soul, your body, spirit and mind I don't look at me like that She won't take you back You said too much You've been too unkind Get up off your back Stop smoking now you could change your life Do you think you'll change their mind? Big <laughs> <laughs> Duffy, ladies and gentlemen. Hey, that sounded great. That sounded great. Well, I love it. That's a new one, isn't it? Yeah. Really nice. Take a seat. Hey, how nice was that? Wasn't that a great song? Was that song from the new Baby Sanders album? Will that be the new material coming out soon? Yeah, that, that song actually is... I, th I think it's going on the album and we've got, you know, a fellow called Bert Yanch? Yes, I do. Yeah, yeah, he's, he's playing on it actually. Wow, that would be incredible. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and and uh, have you finished recording this? You're doing it now? Yeah. We'll, we're all but done now. There's, there's one song that needs tidying up a little bit. Okay. And Stukey titled, so... And uh, am I right thinking your life's a bit calmer now? Yeah, I know, my life is a lot calmer. There's one, there's one thing hanging over my head still. Um, it's a bit unfortunate. Uh, yeah, I mean, about a month and a half, I'm up in court again. Uh, same old. But on the whole, yeah, it's a lot calmer. Okay. And is that because you have been uh, living a quieter life or you haven't been caught leading the wilder life? <laughs> uh, what, what has brought about this period of comparative calm? Yeah, a combination of um, a change in that... Like, the way I live my life and the like, fundamental ways of viewing life and acting and not getting caught yeah. as well. <laughs> that, that's the biggie really, of course, Because <laughs> everyone, everyone likes to let off a little steam in different ways and getting caught is often the issue. Yeah. It's like a fellow in a shop yesterday actually, he was, he was a little Irish player, he had a pen behind his ear and a, a newspaper and he's like, darkly, 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 for f sake, keep it in your pants, you know? <laughs> you might have learned by now. That's it. Cool. And you just wanted a bounty or something, didn't you? You just wanted that. <laughs> Do you get given advice on a regular basis by strangers? Yeah. 
yeah, people, people often, yeah, they take me aside, take it upon themselves to yeah. show me the light or point me in the right direction. Normally different places to hide things and... <laughs> <laughs> Well, you know, there's something about you, because you're, you're, you're a very charming person. When, when someone meets you for the first time, I thought, I remember when I met you, you're very lovable, you're very charming. Um, and there is a, you, you know, people want to look after you, I think. Which is a nice thing, I guess. Mm. Don't worry, I'm not, I'm not grooming you here. I'm not... <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, just don't know what to say. Do you? Yeah, I don't know. It wasn't, Thank you. It wasn't, no, but you know, it's a, uh, but I wonder whether that's a strange thing for you. I mean, have you noticed that? Is it, is it a fair assessment by me there, that, that people do kind of like feel protective towards you, even people who don't know you? Yeah, I mean, but probably for every nine people that want to look after me, there's one that will just wind down the window and shout, Ducky, you plum bag! <laughs> Did you upset the Irish? It always seems to be Irish people. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think I've upset them as well this evening. I didn't mean any harm. Mm. Uh, what, what do you like most? Uh, do you like to write? Uh, do you like to perform? What is it that you enjoy uh, the most when it comes to your music? I don't know, just... Um, Finishing something, really, like a you know, sense of finishing something and achieving something, and then, yeah, and then performing it and having it received. And uh, 